Today I'm here at the Mars Innovation Center with Paul Murtis, and he's going to tell us about a really interesting company. But before that, Paul, tell me a bit about your background in energy. Oh, well, um, I do have a degree in mechanical engineer and specialized in energy a long, long time ago and started out designing heating and cooling systems. Uh, after that, after a career in business, uh, I ended up being the CEO of a company called Clean Energy, which is a uh, geothermal energy company, the state of the art in heating and cooling. Right. Um, and after that, I got involved with Mars and did uh, some investing in early stage clients, all in the clean tech sector. And through my history with Tom Ryan, who's on my board of Clean Energy, uh, came to be involved with this company, Circuit. Great. And uh, you and I are both uh, clean tech um, volunteers, right. and, and now you're working with one of the companies. So I'm really interested in the idea with what Circuit Meter's got. So tell us a little bit of the product. What, do you, what does it do? Sure. Uh, circuit Meter is revolutionary, really. We are scanning the whole environment uh, in metering and energy management technology. We can't find anything that is solved at all competitive. What it is, it is dramatically lower cost electrical metering. When I say that, it's maybe 2% of the cost that's out on the market. It's solid state electronics, and each meter does 36 points. So a dramatically lower cost. And what the lower cost means is that you can afford to meter at the circuit level. And that means that instead of metering at the gate for an entire building or an entire set of buildings, you can measure down to the individual circuit or the individual piece of machinery. That combined with the fact that the meter is measure in real time every two seconds and sends the data back to the cloud means that on our database we have all the information in the facility for every circuit all the time. And so we have real time, we have a historical database. So now you have all the energy information. You can start to look at what is using too much energy. Right. And this is just electricity you're looking at right now? Well, right now we are, but uh, we actually have a new uh, device called J Pulse, which will transmit pulses from gas meters and water meters right. into our same meter and come back to our same dashboard. Right. So that we can, in fact, going forward, include electric and water and natural yeah. gas in our metrics uh, as well. And it's a great example of a company just starting out, you know, a startup company, but has a potential because of the cost savings. I mean, this is really disruptive. For management, for any kind of a company, a food service company, a real estate company, a manufacturer, right now energy is a line item at the bottom that gets allocated across. Right. And they don't have a clue where their energy is going. Right. With, with this technology, it goes from uh, engineers guessing to actually measuring it's almost can go to the managers even the accounts line by line they'll know exactly what is being used when and where and so everything we've found so far with early stage clients is it's all surprises yeah. they don't know what they don't know and right. come back to, our heaters shouldn't be on in the summertime right. our ramps shouldn't be on the summer this shouldn't be operating all weekend all of these things they just don't know then you were telling me about a client that they were you know looking at a, a potential expenditure in the two hundred thousand dollar range to get detailed uh, information on what about 30 or 40 important sources and you thought you would do it for how much eight thousand dollars eight thousand dollars so that's disruptive Typically, what you'll find out in the real world right now is anywhere from as low as thousand dollars a point to maybe twenty five hundred dollars a point. We can measure our hardware at fifty to sixty dollars a point. We, we combine hardware with software, and it's designed for companies that have portfolios of properties and facilities across the country and across the continent. It brings them all together in one. At the same time, they can dive deep to any individual piece of equipment any facility, anywhere, and look at what it did in the last hour, or what it's doing right now. Thank you very much, Paul. Congratulations. We'll look forward to following your, your progress and uh, look forward to seeing a great Canadian success story started right here at Mars. Well, thank you, Peter. Okay, great.